Congratulations. 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 You have achieved a milestone, which is entry into University Science Malaysia as a postgraduate student. Here, on behalf of Institute of Nano Opto Electronics Research and Technology, INO, I would like to share with you all some information about INO, who we are and what we have in INO. I know it's located at Science at USM, approximately 50 minutes drive from the main campus. The map is to show the state where we are, which is Penang. In Malay, we call it as Pulau Pinang. I know it's a center of excellence in research. We offer research and academic programs, services in the field of nanotechnology and optoelectronics. Our vision is to become a global center of excellence in multidisciplinary research field of nanotechnology and optoelectronics. And our mission is to provide high impact research and academic programs for global research prominence and development of local talent and technology for a sustainable nation. I know has five niche research areas. We have nano and advanced materials like emitting diode or laser, sensor, solar cell and power devices. I know is not new in USM. In 2002, because of the IRPA strategic research grant, the NOR laboratory was established with the fully operational of equipment and facilities at that time in School of Physics. In 2014, INO was born. It's the Institute of Nano Opto Electronics Research and Technology as a center of excellence in USM stand alone, separated from School of Physics. In 2015, the Administration Office of INO was established in Science at USM, where we are today. Throughout the years, we have built the offices and also the facilities in the laboratory until today. Now, I know has the full flash solution. We have our research facilities and capabilities. We are able to produce high quality wafers and also can custom wafer based on the requirement from the customer. We also provide fabrication of electronics and optoelectronic devices, we have the capability to provide also lithography services using the high-end instruments in the laboratory, as well as to offer various characterization analysis suited for your needs. There is a total of nine academic staff, including myself, in INO. Each of the lecturers has respective expertise. To know more about them, kindly visit to our webpage at ino.usm.my. Without further delay, let's see what are the academic programs offered by INO. INO offers Doctor of Philosophy and Master of Science Optoelectronics in Research Mode. There is a total of seven research fields in INO. Nanomaterials Fabrication and Characterization Nanomaterials and Devices Nano Devices and Packaging Modeling and Simulation of Nano Optoelectronic Devices Nano Integrated System Solid State Lighting Solutions 
nano optics. I know offers Master of Science and PhD degree in both full-time and part-time MOOCs for your selection. I know also offers Master of Science mixed mode in nano optoelectronics. This Master of Science mixed mode program consists of 30% coursework and 70% research in full-time and part-time modes. A total of 40 units to take in this program, 12 units for the courses and 28 units for the dissertation. We offer elective courses INE 503 and INE 504 in both semesters. Students have the option to choose only one elective course. And this is the online teaching and learning schedule for this semester. Students can feel free to discuss with the lecturers during the first class on the schedule. And this is the list of instructors based upon the courses taught in the Master of Science Nano Optoelectronics program. And please do not forget, in order to graduate from Master of Science Nano Optoelectronics, all candidates must pass all the exams submit dissertation and pass YWA WOSI. Candidate is required to pass each course with GPA of 3.00 or grade B. For graduation, the minimum CGPA is 3.00. Complete the research work as per agreed with the supervisor or co-supervisors, dissertation writing and submission for examination, as well as to attend and pass the YWA WOSI. For international students, they have to pass the Malay language LKM 100 with a minimum of grade C. While for the PhD and Master of Science research mode students, specifically for master students, they need to have at least one article journal accepted or published in journals or proceedings indexed by ISI or Scopus. For PhD students, they need to have at least two articles journal accepted or published in journals indexed by ISI or Scopus. The publications accepted must be published together with the supervisors. The candidate must be the first student author and only the first student author is allowed to use the article to fulfill his or her graduation requirement. Plagiarized article will not be accepted for graduation. And the publications must be related and conform to the candidate's current research in his or her thesis dissertation. Please ensure that the publications accepted must carry USM affiliation. If you have any questions about INO or the academic programs offered by INO, Please do not hesitate to contact us at the following emails and contact numbers. Once again, I would like to welcome all of you to INO Institute of Nano Optoelectronics Research and Technology. And thank you for your attention. <laughs>